In this video, if somebody asks me for 1,000 Robux, I have to say yes. If they ask me for 10,000 Robux, I have to say yes. If they ask me for 100,000 Robux, I have to say yes. If they ask me for 1 million Robux, I, I actually don't know what I'd do in this situation. I'd probably just have to delete my channel or something. Welcome to Please Donate, but I have to say yes to everything. So if you have not seen my previous Say Yes to Everything videos, usually what I do is I go into a random Please Donate server on my main account and say yes to every beggar for 10 minutes. And even though you guys seem to really like how I did it in the past, we're going to change it up a little bit this time and have three phases. Phase one, I will be on one of my alt accounts that is just a bacon for one hour and say yes to everybody who begs me. Phase two, I'll be using a little bit of a wealthier alt account for 30 minutes and of course say yes to every beggar now phase three that will be on this account my main account and that will go on for 10 minutes 10 minutes might not seem like much but believe it or not since most people in please donate know me as somebody with a lot of robux it can get pretty insane all right guys i'm about to click play and it's going to put me in a random server and that's exactly when the timer starts all right, there we go. The timer has now started. All right, so literally whatever they ask me, I have to say yes to, guys. If anybody asks for me for any amount of Robux, I have to say yes. And by the way, if you're wondering how I have the Robux to afford this on my alt accounts, basically I distributed some group funds to each account. And if somehow people asked for so much that I ran out on that account, I still had more group funds that I could distribute if needed. So to start phase one, since I'm on a bacon account, obviously I'm less likely to get begged. So I had to come up with a bit of a strategy, which honestly is a little bit weird to say i have to come up with a strategy to get begged but anyways my strategy was basically i was going to walk booth to booth to make it appear like i'm trying to find somebody to donate and hopefully this will make people realize i might have some robux and then ask me for a donation i'm really curious to see how much a, a bacon is begged bro like i actually have no idea how much a bacon gets begged but we're gonna find out in this one hour time by the time three minutes have passed on the clock i was already starting to realize how much less bacons get begged because on my main account, I'm used to getting begged within the first 10 seconds of joining. So because of this difference, I came up with a new rule. If they ask me for nothing within 10 minutes, guys, I'm going to switch servers. So yeah, basically every 10 minutes, as long as nothing crazy is happening and I'm not getting begged too much, I'll be switching servers. All right, hopefully nobody recognizes my voice, but I'm, gonna, I'm just going to quickly be like, Hello? 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 All right, maybe that'll get somebody's attention. <laughs> it's like a little me, bro. Look at this little guy, bro. He's so tiny. All right, back to strategizing. I'm just gonna type hi. I don't know if that'll get anyone's attention at all, but it's worth a shot. I'm actually amazed at the lack of begging going on here. Okay, actually, this person's saying, please, I see. So I see he's got premium. He looks a little bit like he's got some money. I guess I could see why they'd beg. I don't know if that's a real headless or not. It could be. Little do they know that they could get a lot of Robux if they had just asked me. Okay, I don't know what's wrong with my attention span sometimes, but literally not even six minutes in, I was so bored that I just started hopping around on these stone things around the map. Leave a comment below if you've done this before. So honestly, in this first server, things were looking pretty dry, but then I decided to make this sound. Yeah. And for some reason, that attracted Steve from Minecraft. And finally, I heard those magic words. All right, guys, I just made a noise next to him, and I guess that's all it took, man. He's asking me for a donut. I guess it doesn't really matter how much I do. I'm gonna just give him 10. I love America. He said he loves America. <laughs> Salute to you, man. All right, guys, you know what happens whenever I donate somebody. I, I guarantee somebody else is about to ask me now. So we just unleash the gates. So yeah, maybe 10 Robux isn't the best way to get their attention. All right, next server, here we are. Let's see if we get begged for things. I definitely see a lot of activity, a lot of people walking around, running around. So there's a good chance we'll get asked for something. Since I wanted to make this segment of the video as entertaining as possible, I was trying as many ways as I can to attract as many beggars as possible. I wonder where the best place to like get begged at is, bro. Is it gonna be over here near the boards? But of course, being a bacon, you're often perceived as the poorest in the server. So this did prove to be pretty challenging. Hello? Anyone out there? Hello? After 10 more minutes of peace and quiet with pretty much no beggars in sight, 
I met this guy. Hello, what's up, man? You want Robux? I'm good, man. Thanks, though. You're awesome. Wait. You sound like someone. Dude, I actually thought I was safe. I'm not gonna lie, guys. Talk again. Hello. Dude. Welp. Time to make a run for it. <laughs> Bro, you're liquid. All right, guys, that was crazy. I did not expect that to happen, but uh, we're in a new server now, so. Even though my voice was literally just noticed, I was still having a hard time not using my voice. Bro, are they giving a haircut over here? Yo, you guys getting a cut? Oh, wait, oh, wait, wait, wait. I shouldn't talk. I shouldn't talk. Oh my gosh, I talked again. I gotta stop doing that, bro. After a few more minutes of enjoying and soaking up every moment I could in this beggar-free world, we were officially halfway through phase one. In this new server, even though it might not have worked that well last time, I decided to try again again and do a little donation to hopefully get some attention. There we go. I gave him a couple twos. We'll see what happens. But unfortunately, nobody is coming to me. So I decided to step it up a notch and donate somebody 25 Robux. That should definitely get some attention. And just a few minutes later, this person came up to me. One question. Okay, she's got a question. She said, can you donate me for animation package? I don't know if that's an exact amount. I'll just say, how much do you need? She then ended up asking me for 250 Robux for the animation package so then i followed her to her booth to donate ah there she is oh she's only got 70 rays okay i'm actually kind of happy to help her not gonna lie 250 she asked for it she got it and of course after a pretty good sized donation such as 250 robux we definitely attracted some beggars wait is this guy asking me to look at his stand since this guy only asked me to look at his stand i ended up just giving him 10 robux and then right after that somebody else asked me for robux okay this guy said me oh it's getting real now 250 robux is what it took and i also gave him 10 robux all right let's see if anybody else asks after donating those guys i thought this guy right here was going to beg me but instead he said you got like a stand oh this guy's so nice he wants to give me robux yo guys w rip it's in the comments this guy is so nice man after that we were down to 20 minutes which means it was time to go into the second to last server and i'm not gonna lie the second to last server was pretty dry and i got kind of bored hello i don't know what some robux so yeah, let's just skip to the last server. All right, last server, guys. Here we go, man. Now, I kind of wanted to end off phase one with a bang. So I decided to start off with giving this guy 50 Robux in hopes that it would attract some beggars. All right, there we go. Oh, oh, we already got a runner. Unfortunately, that guy just ran away and nobody begged me for Robux after that donation. But for some reason, when I gave this guy 15 Robux, I actually managed to draw a crowd. Oh my gosh, can me have 100? Oh my gosh, they're all watching me do this too. All right, they're following me now. I know somebody's gonna ask for some more, bro. And sure enough, I was right. So, okay, he's starting to say something. You know what I'm gonna ask you? What are you gonna ask? And of course, he asked for a donation. So I gave him 15 Robux. And then this guy also wanted a donation. Hey, can you please donate by any chance? So I gave him 10 Robux. And at this point, it seemed like everybody was just basically getting in line for the next donation. Oh, this guy too. And I ended up donating this guy and then this guy. Give him a six and also the uh, three. That's nine Robux. Now let's walk away and see if anybody else asks. With about a minute and a half left, I was just walking around the map waiting for some beggars and nothing was really happening. So I decided to drop a random 20. And then with less than one minute of phase one remaining, this guy asked for a donation. Here, we're almost out of time. I'll give you a little more than everyone else. So I gave him a 50. And then right after that, another person wanted some Robux. All right, yo, this guy too. All right, all right. I ended up giving him 10 Robux. And after that, we were officially done with phase one. All right, guys, you know what that means, though. Now it's time for phase two. So as I said at the beginning of the video, for phase two, we're gonna use this account right here, which as you can tell is definitely more wealthy looking than the bacon account. If you look closely, you'll notice that I have this Valkyrie helmet, a fedora, and also this beast mode face. So this should be enough to make a pretty interesting phase two. All right, guys, here we go. Pressing the play button. All right, and just like that, the timer has started. Let's freaking go, dude. Yo, I already got a friend request, bro. I just got here, man. I literally just got here and I got a friend request. What is that? I I'm just waiting for the whoever that is to show up and ask me for some Robux. So just like phase one, I decided to walk around a little bit so that they could see that I might be trying to find somebody to donate and hopefully attract some beggars. So far, I'm surprisingly not being begged, even with like a Valkyrie on and a Fedora on and some giant wings, bro. Like, like literally, like you could see these from a mile away. Does nobody want Robux? Hello? Dude, 
this is not real life. So surprisingly in the first server, even though I had a couple people come up to me and look at me, and even after donating a random person some Robux, I did not get begged at all in this server. So in the next server, to hopefully make things a little more interesting, I decided to immediately start with a donation. With this, hopefully somebody will come beg me. What was that, bro? He just left after di getting the 10. What's the point of that? Honestly, I have no idea why, but even in the second server, it was pretty dry. I'm trying to stay awake at this point, bro. But luckily, in the last three minutes of this server, I was confronted by a beggar. Oh my gosh, this guy said follow me. Okay. Let's go, dude. Let's fall. I'm following you. I'm following you, man. Because I was desperate for beggars at this point since I was so bored, I gave this guy a 50. Maybe that'll get someone's attention. And thankfully, it did draw some attention. Okay, okay. We getting some attention. Hi. Aw, <laughs> uh, no need to be polite. Just, just get to the point. I know what you're here for. You know what you're here for. Would you like to donate me PLS? Yes, I, I would love to. She then told me that she had a goal of 100 Robux. So, of course, I gave her the 100 Robux. 100. All right, who's next? Right after that, this guy right here tried to ask me for another donation and if you didn't know in my last say yes to everything video i had to make a rule where people can't beg me over and over again because people really dislike that one red shirt girl who begged me for robux so many times so instead of him i chose a different beggar oh this is you okay here take a 50 since we're getting really close to the end of phase two i changed my mind and gave her a 100 instead here actually i got you i got you for real and of course, the bigger the donations I did, the more the beggars swarmed me. All right, wait, we got bl Blonde Boy right here saying hi. Can you donate me? Sure. I also gave this guy 100 Robux. And after that, I was donating one person after another pretty much constantly. But eventually, I ran out of people that haven't been donated yet. If you got some, no more. Who didn't get some? Wait a second. These are vultures, bro. They're just coming back for more. So it was finally time for the last server of phase two. All right, last server, here we go. We got about eight minutes left because I left that last server a little bit late since there was so much happening. Let's see what we can do here, bro. In the last server of phase two, I wasn't gonna waste any time, so I immediately donated this person some Robux. And I'm sure you'll be happy to know that this server turned out to be pretty crazy. PLS donate, sad face. Go, 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 go. We got six minutes, six minutes on the clock. Go, 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 go. Here, take a 100. Please donate, please. And it seemed like with every donation, the line just kept getting bigger and bigger. Oh my gosh, here we go. Um, and I'm not gonna lie, I don't speak much Spanish at all, but I was pretty sure that this guy was asking for Robux. I ended up giving him 50 Robux, and I'm not gonna lie, I was actually pretty happy that I joined this server, because if you look at the leaderboard, a lot of these people could really use the Robux. I didn't realize it at first, but it turns out this might have been a Spanish server. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what these guys are saying. I think this guy might be asking for something. <laughs> I don't know what he's saying bro but it was too late to switch servers now so i kind of just followed the guy and he brought me right to his stand i realized he literally had zero robux raised so i bought his 40 and his 30 me ajuda i don't know what he's saying but i assume he wants robux okay and sure enough he led me to his booth and i gave him a 20 and a 10 with only three minutes left on the clock for phase two i tried to do all of these donations as fast as i possibly could so that i could help as many people as possible before the timer ran out and nobody seemed to be asking for exact Christ. robux amounts so i pretty much just gave them whatever i wanted to what is that face bro what is that and once we were down to less than one minute remaining i felt so bad because the last person did not have any buttons on their booth oh my gosh bro no way dude you got no buttons bro's gotta watch my video i literally have a video about how to make buttons on your sign and please donate bro and just like that we ran completely out of time for phase two which meant that it was finally time for phase three all right, guys, time for the moment you've all been waiting for. It's time to join a public server on my main account. As you can see here, I have se Whoa, wait a second, guys. I just realized something. I just reached 10 million donated? Dude, let's go. Guys, wait, I'm not even capping right now, bro. This is actually the first time I'm about, I'm about to pull this out. One second. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my. Yo, that is crazy. If you didn't know, you do have to reach 10 million Robux donated and please donate to get these wings. So I was pretty excited. Dude. Anyways, after having a little bit of fun with the new wings, it was finally time to click the play button and go into a public server on my main. All right, guys, as soon as I press this button, 
Oops. All right, the timer's begun, guys. I'm not gonna lie, I was actually pretty scared starting phase three because I was already starting to kind of run low on Robux for my channel, and I don't really have many ways of getting Robux right now. Holy, I hope nobody notices me right away. Oh my gosh, I'm nervous. I'm just gonna try to try to sneakily make my way over here and hopefully nobody notices me. Oh, I'm so nervous. Oh no. And in less than 30 seconds, we got our first beggar. Can you dono me, please? All right, he didn't say how much, so that's a good start. I started off with a 10 Robux donation to be safe. But that safety did not last long because right after that, I found myself surrounded by people. This guy said, look, wait, mind donating? I need some funds. Sure. I got you. And even though he didn't ask for it, I decided to give him a hundred just to make things more interesting. This is getting scary, bro. More people are gathering. Could I please have 100 Robux too? Sure you can. Sure you can have 100 Robux too. Hey, they're so happy. When I stepped in the server to start phase three, I never would have expected to run into some really wholesome fans. Look, wait, you are my best friend. I love you videos. Yo, what is up with this wholesomeness, bro? He said, hey, this person said sub to look, wait. And honestly, people like this really motivate me to keep going. So thank you if you're one of these people. After that little wholesome interaction, this guy right here gave me the easiest yes in this entire video. First, he asked to see my wings. Do you have the wings by chance? And of course, I could not resist <laughs> and then after that he asked me to hit him with my smite hammer oh he said can you hit me with the hammer i got you bro all right, that's an easy request. After that, a couple of minutes passed on the clock and I couldn't believe it, but I wasn't getting begged like at all. With four minutes left on the clock, I said, dude, nobody's asking me for Robux right now. What is going on? And then literally right after I said that, I met another beggar. Is he asking for a donation? I think I think he is. Let me just give him a hundred. I actually have no idea if he's asking for a donation. Oh my gosh, somebody said this reminds me of the only yes vid. Oh my gosh, they're onto me, bro. I'm so scared now. Please donate me. I'll show you where my booth is. Okay, okay, I got you. Here's 100, here's 100. Oh wait, this guy said me. Okay, there's 100, man. Oh wait, he said please 200. Oh, uh, you know what? That's my fault, bro. I didn't even see that. You know what? Here's 200, bro. <laughs> oh my gosh, two minutes left. After that, this guy came back up to me and wanted me to donate him just so that I could appear on his leaderboard since he was a fan. Since he was a fan and we were down to the last two minutes, I decided to go a little crazy. I'll give him a thousand, bro. This is gonna be, this is gonna get crazy. We're down to the last minute 40. Oh my oh god! My god. god. <laughs> Love you too, bro. With about one minute remaining, this guy came up to me and asked for 50 Robux. Oh, wait, this guy said, can I have 50? Uh, sure, 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 sure. Oh my gosh, 57 seconds. We're almost out of time. And he's walking so slow, bro. Hurry up, man. Since we were almost out of time, I decided to give him 1,000 Robux instead. I'd like, wait, come. Oh my gosh, 10 seconds and this guy is walking so slow. Where is your stand, bro? Oh, it's this one? Okay, I got you, I got you. Since we were pretty much out of time, I bought the biggest button he had, which was only 300 Robux. And just like that, I somehow survived another Say Yes to Everything video.